welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be demoing this little lace front here. This is actually my first human hair lace front. I'm not used to these at all. I usually do deal with like the synthetic ones that are hard to manipulate. And right now in this clip, I'm just showing you what, what it comes with. It comes with a black cap, but um, it doesn't look skin-like, so I didn't use that. So yeah, I'm just showing you in this clip what I got. Um, and this hair is actually, this video is not sponsored. So I've worked with Labby hair in the past and their hair was like great quality and I wanted a wig from them again but I didn't want to ask for free hair so I just purchased it from them. Yes, purchased it because I also knew I was going on vacation and I needed some new hair. So I didn't want to just um, buy any old hair. I wanted a company that I trusted and I worked with them before and the hair was really good. So this is how the wig looks. It comes with three combs um, and this is actually like some amazing hair. This is Brazilian. I think I got it in 22 inches. Natural wave. And the lace, let me tell you guys, this is exactly how it comes. You see that right there? I didn't have to pluck anything, tweeze anything, the baby hair. Everything came exactly like that. All I had to do was cut the lace off in the front, up front there, and um, bleach it. So I used 40 volume developer. You're gonna see that in a second. So I turned it over on the mannequin head. 40 volume developer with bleaching powder mix it up make sure it was thick um, when you mix it make sure when you turn it over in a cup it doesn't spill so if it spills it's probably too thin so just make sure the you get a really nice white paste um, I left it on for like five minutes ten minutes not too long because it's 40 volume 40 volume developer so it's really really strong and this is exactly how it came out amazing like I can't believe how amazing like the front looks I didn't have to tweeze anything so I'm definitely gonna be ordering some more in this next clip I'm gonna be showing you guys how I apply the lace I use got to be gel I don't have time for bold hole because I like my edges I don't want them to <laughs> rip off so I use the black one first to lay my own baby hairs down and I blow dry it blow drying is key because you need it to dry and then I use a brown cap like this one when you get the hair from them they don't send you a brown cap they actually give you a black one which it's uh, yeah because it doesn't look like scalp so you, you, you're gonna need to get you a brown cap sister then I spray the cap with um, free spray from got to be and this kind of keeps it in place so when you cut it it doesn't just like fall off your head so I'm spraying a lot like a generous amount and then I'm blow drying it and when you blow dry it after a while it gets like really really hard so this will probably last you about two to three days which is enough for me um, I don't want my lace to be on my head for like a week or two weeks straight um, I use my foundation that's my skin color by the way it's <laughs> my skin is probably looking darker in this video because this is like after vacation so I didn't get to record the full video um, before my vacation because I had so much things to do um, so yeah you put the foundation on let it dry and then I'm using the got to be glue water resistant to um, lay the weight the lace down so you're gonna put the glue in between your your actual scalp and the the wig cap so it kind of camouflages and when you put this on you're gonna actually let it dry too so I put the wig on and I'm out let me tell you guys, I'm not the best with baby hairs, so <laughs> I just did a little something something here. Not the best. I'm I thank the Lord that this this wig, like everything came as it is. Like I'm just so glad I didn't have to customize anything. But I'm I'm trying a little thing right here with the baby hairs. And I use mousse because I've seen in um videos that using got to be gel it kind of makes the hair hard. So I got mousse. I'm just putting it behind my ear. And then I put my um, scarf over it to kind of like melt the lace into your skin. So the flatter it is on your head, the more natural it looks. And this is the finished product. I am absolutely in love with it. I wish I joined the lace life earlier, but better late than never. Um, I am going to try to customize this lace because I do realize the baby hairs are a little bit too long. So they do look kind of messy in the front so I'm gonna try to customize that and thank you guys for watching my video this is the end of it um, my next vlog is actually my uh, 
my next video is actually going to be a vlog of DR because me and my friends, um, we went to DR for vacation, so stay tuned for that.